This is Handelsblatt Global Edition in Berlin, and these are today's top stories. A bit of breathing room for Angela Merkel amid the refugee crisis. Ahead of a party convention on Monday, the German Chancellor agreed to compromise with her own conservatives on how to handle the flood of refugees. Merkel is still refusing to cap the flow, but reportedly will now agree to significantly limit their entry into Germany. While largely semantic, the pact should ease political pressure on Merkel. Deutsche Bahn's CEO under pressure amid record loss. CEO Rudiger Gruber's future at the German rail operator could be determined Wednesday during a crisis meeting with its government owners. Plagued by strikes and delays, Deutsche Bahn is once again lowering its 2020 revenue targets, Handelsblatt has learned. The state-owned railroad plans a record 1.3 billion euros in losses for 2015, and the government has called an emergency meeting to discuss the CEO's latest turnaround proposal. European Union resurrects Turkey's stalled bid to join the 28-nation bloc. After a five-year hiatus, Turkey today resumes negotiations in Brussels on its bid to enter the European Union. The talks come a month after EU leaders agreed to give Turkey 3 billion euros in aid to keep Syrian and Iraqi refugees from entering the EU. The discussions had stalled on Ankara's political and human rights record, but are being restarted in light of Turkey's new leverage in the refugee crisis.